good evening fans today in this tutorial i am going to talk about uh, routing protocol it's our topic today as you know fans uh, router computing topic and i had been covered in last tutorial and today in this tutorial i am going to talk about a routing protocol it's our topic today so fans first of all i would say to you all if you have visited to our channel narish english spoke and please subscribe hit the bell icon to get latest videos uh, about computer hardware networking and english speaking presentation etc and well, let's talk about a uh, routing protocol friends you know our routing protocol specifies in a how routers and communicate in a with each other to distribute information that enables them to select routes and a between nodes and on a computer network routers and perform the traffic directing functions on the internet data packets are forwarded through the network of the internet from a router to <clears throat> router to router until they reach their destination computer or routing algorithms determine the specific choice and of route each router has a prior knowledge and only of networks attached to it in a directly a routing protocol shares this information first among immediate in the neighbors and then throughout the network this way routers this way routers gain knowledge of the topology of the network the ability of routing protocols to dynamically adjust to the changing conditions and such as and disabled connections and components and route data around and obstructions and is what and gives the internet its fault tolerance and high availability the specific the specific characteristics and routing protocols and include the manner in which and they avoid and routing routing and loops and the manner in which and they select preferred and routes and using information about of course the time that they require the tune region or in coverage coverage ends or their scale ability and other factors such as relay multiplexing and cloud access and framework and parameters are certain additional character characteristics and such as a multi layer interfacing and may also be employed as a means of distributing uh, uncompromised and the network in a gateway is to authorized authorized and ports and this has the added the added and benefit of preventing issues and with the routing and the protocols and the loops and many routing protocols and are defined in technical standards and documents called rfcs so fans and how did you like this tutorial like share comment for me and thanks for watching